So this is the website of original. Now, whenever if you even if you uh, uh, you know type the urkun, it will be taken to the original. So original.com. Okay, original.com. So if say for example, I'm having an ID, this is the thing you can have just the product, okay, and all the things. But what are you seeing here? Oh, everything is similar. Don't worry, everything is similar. Just check it out that in this products you can have if you want to buy our for resources you can go to the uh, the webla knowledge hub and support you can have, you must go to the guides and tutorials as we have shown in the earlier version of Orkun, the guides and tutorials are available on the different uh, types quick start guide to original quick start to the analysis report how you should go to the analysis uh, how you should do it it is all there and tutorials are available there okay just say for example if you want to go for the this one first quick start guide just go it and you can download this thing original start guide and introduction to using original so using original via your lms whatever this is, you will get each and everything and just go through these uh, two uh, the main things if i say this one this one is second one is guide to the analysis report the guide to the analysis report you can also see that uh, when it, whenever it is opened you can check it out uh, with the help of that uh, i'm just again uh, sharing you that uh, so this does this is the thing which you can check it out i'm not going to open it just you open it and you will uh, see the entire things whatever uh, whatever i'm telling you at this moment uh, will be available and uh, if you have any confusion you can go through this second link and the user guide can be available i'll be giving you the uh, user guides uh, that link directly onto their uh, comment in the comment box you can check it out as my team can also give you uh, the comment just hold on that i'm so that i can i may be available to to you know they give you the link and this the link hold on yeah i'm giving to my team and the, my team member will be uh, giving you the, that documents link to your open comment okay so friends let me take you to the login first so in the login there are two kind of login so login we are we are not in the admin panel login the web inbox so web inbox in the global one you just have to click here if you are having that particular id i have clicked so it is preparing can you see here so what we will get the next page where you will have this you will be directed to this page getting it so welcome to the original this is the page we are getting and i have my username and password which i have got from my institute i will just put these credentials and sign in got it now these are the my previous tasks whatever i have done okay what you have to do you have to click create this is my dashboard i have to click create click upload folders and maybe if i'm going uh, for some articles maybe just a minute i'm just at randomly i'm checking a, a document uh, for you hold on say for example this is uh, one of our paper or maybe uh, yeah maybe this is dot paper i'm giving you the uh, thing say for example this is the paper I have selected a particular paper I have selected. So I am having this analysis address. I have to select this. I can also give this email ID to my student and he or she can just send the document which needs to be checked for similarity in this email ID only and that will be the report will automatically be generated and will be sent to me not to the student. Okay subject you can uh, just read uh write the subject manuscript test trial whatever you want to go with that message if you want to have and upload the file 
this is the file has been uploaded and depending on the you know time this is the document first submission id you must remember d triple one zero and whenever the report will be there this submission id will be there it is very important to note can you see here this is the document id whatever i have submitted this document id is very important i will let you know why and when so this is this has not been checked and when if i go to my email id i will get that 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 particular email uh, the of confirmation of submission will be landing in my personal email and whenever the report will be generated it will be here so it is it may take the time depending on the length of the document i'm just refreshing this page so that if it is available meanwhile say for example uh, i have uh, done the i'm just uh, this will be showing that whenever the similarity check will be completed by the software it will be showing that what is the percentage similarity there i have done this report on this thing i'm just opening this report for you i you just click it here when it is available can you see here this is loading update par hai kya ki nahi i think let me check you let me check okay so you just need to click you just need to click the report okay i i have to stop sharing and then again uh, go to that particular thing uh, that particular id again so far what we have learned number 1 number 1 thing that how to log in there how to upload the document for the similarity and when the pers and to note down the document id these are the three important aspects now let me take you to the uh, next step whenever uh, the report will be generated you will be getting a particular you will be getting a particular uh, yeah this chrome tab maybe i think i should go to the this complete window i i should take i think it should should be hmm. this can we see this uh, anal analysis overview is it visible okay dr lokesh please confirm yeah please it's visible that's yeah. okay that's perfect. wonderful yeah. okay uh, so this is the analysis overview and the complete report is available that 10 matching text is available 12 warnings are there view the entire document okay these are the uh, this, this is the compilation what is the, again this is the th student uh, thesis there submission id is this so the, by this way i can have the uh, look on that now view the entire document now i want to see the all the pages okay yeah i want to see the all the pages then i can go through this document otherwise uh, you quick document overview you just download you just download this entire uh, document entire document or entire report by this so what i can do that quotes and brackets can be on but by default it is off because whatever in quote can't will not be included in the similarity whatever included in the bracket will not be included in the similarity so these things are there so what you can you can go for export the report you can have the complete report with you and you can check it out page by page say for example i am checking this page so this page is giving you that this is the document and yeah and include in analysis or exclude in analysis say for example a sample uh, in particular thing it is showing that this is where this is the similarity in this particular paper this particular page this is the whether you want to include the suspicious use of characters or symbols it is showing so you may exclude them say for example it is your own paper own source is there for example this page i am talking about okay this portion i am talking about it is talking about the warning or thing i can include an exclude box is like this can you see here include analysis Yeah, it is included in as at this time. If you want to exclude it, say for example, it is that particular paper is your own paper, then 
you can just exclude it from analysis on whatever the changes are there they are auto saved in general whatever you are creating so view the entire document this way you can see the entire document so whatever you are getting can you go through because this is very uh, exhaustively prepared document so very less similarity is there so say for example this is the thing uh, this is the matching text uh, i have shown i have been shown by the report that in the colored version this is the you can include or exclude that particular source that whether it should be counted in the similarity or not uh, in that particular report that's why the in this particular entire report the similarity is very much less but you can you always have the option as a supervisor as a librarian only to include or exclude if it is your own paper you just click exclude okay so it the that thing will be excluded from thing say for example i take you to my uh, another uh, yeah. say for example i'm taking you another document i'm taking you to the another document on the original site meanwhile we can also check whether the uh, analysis report have been prepared type say for example whatever can you see here in the curcumin paper which we have uploaded the similarity is 5% by this report just we have got now whatever we have submitted we can also see that document but i am not going to that uh, document i am just seeing that uh, let's see the entire document okay entire doc it is showing that it is it has got this much similarity uh, let me check the entire document entire document so i can see that the in the colored version the source and from where it has been copied and the source will be marked there so this say for example this is a colored version now i want uh, i know that the, it is showing that from this document it is 64% match for this from taylor and francis this article say for example this article is mine only from out of the research work i want to exclude it this is a but obvious that whatever you have published uh, is your uh, thing it should not be copied it should not be treated as copied one or similarity one because it's the output of your research so you can just exclude it but remember this exclusion will be marked in the report you cannot go for excluding each and everything and claiming that i have the zero percent similarity no you can't do that okay so if i go for this uh, by this way i can so by this way the obviously the Uh, similarity will be reducing but obviously either it can be done only in the cases when the paper is yours or paper is in creative commons and you have um, attributed to the source only so this is the way and just you have to what you need to do when you have done with this thing uh, say for example similarity is 28% for this document say for example i have done this this document can you see here yeah this document is 95% say for example this is my uh, my article this is my article i have done it excluded excluded it is it was 28% remember 20 it is now 26% for this way whatever is not relevant to you whatever you can justify you can put exclude as a supervisor or as a librarian not student can do student can do this thing you have if you are student you have to convince your supervisor or the librarian that this is your document only and from that because otherwise you cannot copy from any source okay so this particular document which we prepared uh, which we were checking actually i was checking for a particular uh, manuscript when i was going through so i found it 28% copy so technically it is automatically ejected and you can just download this import export analysis report as pdf and the pdf will be shown to you i'm just going through the P, uh, pdf now yeah so now can you see here it is the original report which is before me i'm i will click here and it will be before me can aap dekh pa rahe can you see it uh, that uh, please dr lokesh dr mona ha yes it's visible the report is visible yeah, yeah this pdf is available now in this yeah, pdf in the analyzed PDF. document it is showing this id that most important thing is document id that document yeah. id you must note this is d982821521 
why i'm saying again and again but first of all source included in the report say for example you are very uh, you know very clever you are your supervisor your librarian is very wise so he somehow he managed to have the similarity of 0% or 1% 2% by clicking just ex some exclusion but remember whatever the sources are included in the report will be there okay uh, will be there and the report will be available that link will be available but if you have done it earlier and you want to again go for submission then it will be showing higher percent 70% 100% because it is already in the cloud so what you need to do however it is the in the purview of librarian that with production of this document id d9a2a2152 the, or whatever the the document is having that can be removed from the uh, cloud if you are redoing the similarity after doing the correction got my point what is the importance of this document id and there is also support id uh, by which by the original support team you can just uh, put it there and it is uh, removed within 24 hours okay so need not to worry if you have done some pre work with the original pre search with the similarity you can remove it from the cloud and again check it out otherwise if you have got 28 27% and 26% similarity okay now i am going text by line by line whatever have been matches there okay this report looks like that so i'm when i'm focusing to trying the reduction of the similarity what will happen that uh, even after working on that when i have managed to almost all the similarity when i'll redo the thing without removing the same document from the cloud of that software obviously the report will show the higher similarity than the earlier version of in fact it, it may show 80% 100% even so don't forget to remove it from cloud otherwise in the software like turnitin by default from the cloud uh, in 3 months it goes in authenticate in 3 months it uh, it is vanished okay from the cloud that is meant for similarity only okay so your document you should take care when you are submitting it for the thesis and all that so this is all about the presentation of this document and you can put this document the first page or second page or third last part, um, depending on the requirement with your thesis however this document must be produced either by your supervisor or by the librarian only as a student we, we are not entitled to go for the similarity check so this is all about the original with the new version itself thank you for connecting with us